everyone, this is Cindy, and I'm going to be showing you how to set up a tracking campaign. And um, so what you're going to do is first you're going to get your link, and then I'm going to show you how to do tracking. Um, and, the, and the reason why tracking can be important is when you start branching out, I know most of you are probably going to start either posting on Craigslist or you're going to start posting on Facebook, one or the other. Once you have a um, sense of how to go about doing that um, through whatever um, area you start with, and I really do suggest Craigslist first, um, once you have that down and branching out, you want to make sure you're, you're seeing where your traffic is coming from because you want to be able to see, you know, if you're not getting traffic from one place, you want to be able to post somewhere else. And so you want to track your links. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to tracking and you can get to tracking either by going to social and tracking here or from your home page you can go to um, you can scroll down to the control panel and my, mine looks a little di bit different than yours because I'm logged into the admin panel to do this but you could also click tracking here and we'll also bring you to the tracking page and then what you're going to do it's very easy you're going to um, go here and let's say you want to set up one for um i'm going to do another facebook one so let's say i want to do one for facebook so you're going to go in here and you're going to type in excuse me you're going to type in <laughs> the um name of the um place where you're doing it at and i'm going to put facebook um three because i think i already have two already set up and then i'm going to click then you're going to set up click set up tracking and then you're going to come over here and you're going to find the category where your main site is so if your main site is the forty dollar site you would go to forty if your main site is the fifty dollar site you would go to fifty and so on and so forth so i'm going to go to forty and you're going to pick what page you want to assign to your tracking so i'm just going to click assign to tracking for this one and then you're going to see your um, link is going to be right here. See at the very end, tracking equals Facebook 3. And this would be the link that you would promote with. But what I would suggest that you do is if you're going to track and you're going to, um, you're going to want to also mask your link too and make it short because you see I mean, you see how long this link is, so you do, you're never going to re be able to remember that unless you put it into like a document or something. So the best thing to do is to take this link, come over here to IBO Toolbox, create a new IBO just like I showed in my previous video, you know, and since this one would be Facebook, this would be called Facebook 3, and then you just put that whole website link in here. And then just create it exactly like um, I showed you in the um, How to Mask Your Link with IBO Toolbox video. And then you would promote with that .NET alias. So that's how to set up a tracking campaign and also how to um, mask it through IBO Toolbox. So if anyone has any questions, just let me know. I'm always around somewhere, so just reach out to me. And I will see you all all on the next video or inside the MED Awesome Facebook group. Later. Bye.